Turo. Turo. Turo is a car rental business. Um, so like your car out there right now, you could rent it out. And it's an app on your phone. Somebody could be a businessman could come in town for three days and need a car for three days. It might be parked at the airport, you know, and you they drive the car. You got the insurance options through Turo. I haven't done it yet, but this is the reason I went so hard at establishing business credit. Yeah, you Just, mentioned it earlier. Your son has an interest or, or looking into yeah. that. So that's what I, you said it earlier. I didn't know what that was. I've mm -hmm. never heard of that. Is that well developed in Galesburg? Okay. Through, I, I've uh, heard about it, but I don't. I've, I've there's about three heard. or four guys that are doing it in between yeah. here and, and the Quad Cities and, Gales, and Peoria and Galesburg. My sister in law is real big into it out in Phoenix. Used mm. to live out there, and she uh, she's probably got five cars in rotation. Yeah, big but, cities. And I was going to say, obviously, that's a bigger area. Yeah, they're yeah. your license plate, your title, all that, right? Yeah, but if you have it in the business name. Right, right. The but, business. Yeah, so. correct. But you can, yes, you could still use your own personal vehicle to rent it out. Mm -hmm. and gain income off of it yeah. so i'm looking at it as just a simple math process like let's just say i get a car and it's 300 dollars a month but if i'm making a thousand dollars a month simple math mm -hmm. there's seven let's say after my bills 250 300 insurance whatever depreciation even, a little yeah bit yeah too. even if it's 500 dollars a month that's still net profit mm -hmm. that's just how i view it you know and it's just going to go into one pot and continue to hopefully multiply Mm -hmm. And then does the person uh, renting the car, do they make a payment to Turo? They make a payment directly to you, but Turo does take um, their cut. And I'm not, I'm not going to act like I'm an expert on it because I'm not 100% no, on it, mm -hmm. but the premise I have of it, you know, you're getting paid off of this. Of yeah. course, you're going to give a cut to the platform yeah. that, mm. that's dealing. Yeah, we're know. giving them free advertisement. So Turo, please <laughs> yeah. sponsor. Yeah, you should yeah. Sp Turo? Sp sponsor. We're looking for a sponsorship, Turo. <laughs> 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 but yeah, no, that's cool. I've never, never even heard of that, man. Yeah, the business cr that, that was such a crash crash course. I was mentally exhausted after that. Have you thought about um, getting into Airbnbs or anything like that? Yeah, I have. I personally don't think there's a big market for it around here. Mm -hmm. There is. I mean, not big, but there's a little there, bit. Yeah, there is. I know there's there's a handful of people doing it in the community. Yeah, yeah. If you think about, because um, I would when I first heard it, I'm like, nah, that won't work. Because Airbnb, I was thinking how I would use an Airbnb. Mm -hmm. Um, but people will come say, oh, you know, my maybe an elderly parent. And I'm going to be here. She fell. I'm going to be here for three to five months yeah. to take care of mom, get her back right. Um, mm -hmm. I don't want to be in a hotel, uh, Airbnb. So people are looking, believe Correct. it or not. And so like when I heard that, I'm like, oh, man. See, I was in my own way thinking like people are coming to vacation here. They're, it's yeah, not going to happen. Because people yeah. usually relate Airbnb to a vacation place or sure, touristy right. area. It, it's not only no. that, you know? Yeah, and I would, say that, I would say that's a small percentage. The rest is people visiting family. You know, we got three colleges in this area. Right. Families College visiting College graduations, them. everything like yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Not only that, sense. but people visiting the Alumni, people. come yeah, back alumni. from home, whatever. Mm -hmm. So yeah, there, there is a need. Wedding, that, family coming yeah. from other states, other towns, because they, there's wedding going on here. So there is, yeah. a, there is a good demand, I would say. Yeah, I'm definitely open to it. Just mm -hmm. haven't, haven't established it yet. Yeah. But definitely, I mean, I've, I've, I listen to Bigger, Bigger Pockets podcast, too. Mm -hmm. And they talk a lot about Airbnb, Airbnb. There's one guy on there that that's strictly what he does. Right. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, he's just adamant about it. So, I mean, I definitely think it's profitable. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, if you yeah. can fit eight people in your house, you can charge 400 a night because that's going to be extremely cheap for everybody. Yeah. Yep. Way cheaper than any hotel you're going to find. It's going to be the worst hotel. So that's why it works. People, big groups, they look for a yeah. house, pay mm -hmm. happily. You you charge the the, the cleaning fee, the, which the gas pays for that as well. So yeah. you just deal with management and cleaning yeah. for the next guest. So yeah, it, it works a little bit. Yeah, absolutely. There's like I said, there are many ways to make money, right? It's true.